Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to take the video that you just made and to um, make it um, into a YouTube video. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to come up here and get my three little circles, four little circles at the very top. And then I just made a movie for my physical honors class. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take uh, the video that I just made and I am going to um, copy it. First of all, I want to see if this is it first. Hello, everybody. Hey, so we are now going to go in our book to page 232. Yep. So that is the, that is the video. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this and I'm going to move it to my physics honors class because it is for my physics honors kids. Okay. The next thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to go down to where my file folder is and I am going to go to where I have my files. Now, I just moved that to my physics honors file. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to open that up. This here was a video that I used today for day seven, so I have several of them, but this right here is from page 232 um, and, uh, and through 239. I think I can do that, and I'm going to hit enter because I want to rename that so that I can, um, when I put it on a YouTube, it will make sense to me. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to drag that into my day seven. I'm going to open up my day seven. I'm going to go to the one I just named. See how I've named all of them so I'll know which video goes with which one. I'm going to right click and I'm going to copy this and then I'm going to go and save it on my C drive so that I know where it's at. I'd like to have another copy. This one here actually puts it in the document camera, and sometimes I forget how to get there. So then I'm going to go to my C drive. I'm going to go to my drive that I have my stuff on. Um, this here is 2020 spring. This is for my physics honors class. This is for my week two online, and this is my day seven. Okay, and so I'm going to right click it and I am going to paste it here. Now, now I have it there. The next thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to get on my Google Drive. So, when I get to my Google Drive, and this is day seven, I'm going to go ahead and upload it, file upload, and then I'm going to go and choose the video I just got finished doing. So what's happening here is it's uploading it to my Google Drive. So I'm kind of waiting for it to upload. Once it uploads, the next thing that I'm going to do is I am going to go onto YouTube and I am going to upload it onto my YouTube video. And the reason why I do that for is sometimes these MP4 um, videos take a while to load up for the kids. And then plus, I'd like to have it saved somewhere else also. Because listen, you can't save it enough as far as my philosophy goes. So now it's telling me I'm actually finished uploading it. Now I'm going to go to my YouTube. Okay. So on my YouTube, I'm going to go to my videos. Look at here, how many I've already got made. And <laughs> I'm going to have to figure out some way to be able to upload these or make these separate so I can find them because I don't really like how it's organized, but it's okay. So I'm going to go up here to this little button here to create a video or post. I'm going to upload a video. And then I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to select my file. All right, 232 to 239 is what I just got finished doing. So I'm going to hit that and I'm going to open it.
I'm going to go over here and I'm going to put honors physics and that's page 232 to 239 and that was on Newton's law of universal gravity. I'm just doing that because that's what I'd like to have on there. Maybe I probably could go down here and I probably could go here and take this and cut this and paste it down here as a description so that my file name is smaller. That'll be fine. So then what I'm going to do is I'm going to scroll down because as you can tell here it's still loading. It's going to take a while to process. Thumbnail, um, I haven't tried that yet. Playlist, I haven't tried that yet. Um, add your videos to one or more playlists. Maybe that's something I'm going to look into next. Audience, yes, this is for kids. Uh, and more options. So I went into more options earlier today. And I actually chose um, uh, a language caption. And I did uh, sign language, so I'm curious to see what uh, American Sign Language, and I'm curious to see what that has entailed. I'm not sure. I'm going to look at the video later. I'm going to go ahead and go down here, and uh, ABCE, that's English. English, and that is not the United Kingdom, sorry. That is the United States. And so that's um, pretty much what I'm going to do with this one. There's nothing else that I'm going to do yet, but I'm going to try some other things later. So, uh, show how many viewers liked or disliked your video. Well, I'm just curious to see how many people actually saw it. Because this right here will tell me if the kids um, are actually watching it, which is awesome. I'm going to skip this one because I haven't tried that yet. And then I'm going to go to the unlisted part. The unlisted part is for that you're going to go ahead and put it on uh, and on, they need a link to get to it. Uh, the other options that you have is public or private. Public anybody can see. Um, private is only people that you want to choose to see. You can actually have it go to public and, and schedule it. Uh, it says before you check this the following, did, did kids appear in this video? Well, no kids were. It was just me. Looking for the overall content guidance. Are, uh, and it just talks about what they're doing there. So what I'm doing now is I'm kind of waiting for it to finish up. And it has finished up. Now, this one's almost 13 minutes. Which I'm really surprised. There are some times that you will do this. And it will tell you your video is too big. Um, and um, I guess 13 minutes is not too long. Thank God. So, here... When you go here, this is where I actually go and I actually um, copy this video link. And the reason why I do that for is because it puts it on your clipboard for you. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to just close that. Well, there's my video that I just got finished doing. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go up here to my Physics Honors eLearning um, tab for today. So that's today's video. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go here and I'm going to write, I'm going to edit this one. So here is just basically tell them what the problems they're supposed to watch. They have to watch this lecture, um, attach a one pager, and I still got to put a quiz up. But so far I've got my choice board. So the only thing I'm going to do now is I'm just going to add a YouTube video. I'm going to right click. I'm going to paste it. And then I'm going to uh, look for it. And there it is. I'm going to add it to here. And then I'm going to save it. And that is all you have to do. So it's very simple. So use this to help you. And if I find out any more other tips, I will let you know.